the episode of Seinfeld, The Race, we meet Jerry's old high school nemesis, Duncan, who's been bitter for years that Jerry unfairly beat him in a running race, which Duncan claims Jerry only won because he got a head start. Nevertheless, all their classmates were focused on the outcome of the race. Jerry crossed first, so he's the winner, right? Actually, by focusing only on this narrow piece of the race, his classmates missed out on the critical information at the beginning that predicted Jerry's success, those crucial first steps. I study the lives of groups of people and predict their health outcomes by looking at the crucial first steps of their lives, the circumstances that occurred during their childhood. While most health researchers focus only on the present to understand health, I take a more innovative approach. I look backwards to understand the present and the future. To do this, I make use of longitudinal data, which is data that follows folks over the course of many years of their lives, and mathematical models to tell a story about how childhood disadvantage, like experiences of violence or poverty, set some children behind right at the start of the race. Specifically, my research links childhood disadvantage to outcomes like smoking, alcohol, or obesity, and pinpoints why some youths initiate these behaviors at earlier ages than their peers. My research informs public health officials, policymakers, and clinicians alike to look to the starting gate to understand the finish line and gives hope for every child to have a Jerry Seinfeld Superman head start. Thank you.